Yo, what's up guys, it is Saints fan, and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 video. Today, we're going to be talking about mods online, and sorry for this video sort of going up really late on a Sunday, but uh, I've been super busy. I've been actually researching, because I am actually going to be getting a new PC soon. A lot of you guys have commented on the fact that my PC sucks, and you, you know, you just normally see like frames dropping in the videos, and that's just because my PC is kind of old, and it's not really that great for recording and playing the game on, so... I have been doing a lot of research, especially if you follow me on Twitch and, and Twitter, you would know that I am going to be doing that. So that's kind of why, or that's kind of what I've been up to the past few days. So hopefully like in a week or two, you should be seeing a lot better gameplay. But getting into what we're going to be talking about on this video, this guy, and I'll go ahead and leave the Reddit post in the description, but this guy, I'll put the picture on the screen. He said that he called Rockstar to support to ask them about the field of view mod. The person who answered the phone wound up saying, you should not be banned if all the mod does is allow you to have a wider field of view. And the proof that he has, I'll put that picture on the screen. You see at the bottom, it says that he called and asked a question about a mod. Now, the reason I'm bringing this up is because if you guys have watched my GTA Mod Shop video yesterday, we talked a little bit about this and the Sweet FX mod, like some of the texture graphic mods that have been out. And I said, just be careful of using them in online because we don't know yet whether or not Rockstar will ban you. And although you may think that, you know, it's just a field of view mod or it's just a graphics mod, it's not affecting other people's experience and it's nothing that's going to make you super overpowered in the game. It still might get picked up on like their anti-cheat system. Now, a lot of people have been using these mods in online for the past few days and nothing's happened. But maybe Rockstar is doing sort of what they've done on consoles where it takes a few weeks for people to get banned or to be moved into the cheaters pool now when i saw this post on reddit like i said i'll link it in the description now although this isn't from like the official rockstar twitter or from their newswire it is technically from them because it's from their support page now again you know we have seen in the past rockstar support has made some mistakes and they've said some wrong things but this is a good news in my opinion because now if anything you know you say you do get banned in the future you can always come back to this and say well you told somebody else that they should be good now, despite seeing this, I'm still going to, like, try to figure out and see if we can get some sort of official word from, like, actual Rockstar themselves, whether it's on Twitter or somewhere, just just so we know, you know, what their official stance is. Like, obviously, we know already they don't really appreciate or they don't like mods, but in my opinion, I think a field of view or a graphical mod isn't that bad and should be allowed online. Uh, and that's actually kind of where I want to end this video. What do you guys think? Now, obviously, like, trainers and, and mods like that that will break the game, clearly those shouldn't be in online, or at least in free roam online. However, what is your opinion on these field of view mods as well as the graphics mods? Do you think they should be allowed online, or do you think everybody should just stay, you know, the same thing like it is right now? Default GTA looking the way it is. But that is pretty much it. Again, like I said, uh, this is just a little update. I wanted to share this with you guys. Again, hopefully we'll find out an official statement from Rockstar soon because so many people are wanting to know. But once that happens, I will be sure to make another update video letting you guys know. So subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss that. Go ahead and like the video if you did enjoy it. But as always, see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.